for? What a great idea. Byron Elton is joining me now. He's the president and CEO of Carbon Sciences. I, I don't understand. I won't pretend to understand the science behind this one. What is it that you're doing with CO2 uh, to, to, to help uh, save it from getting out into the environment? Good morning, Ali. Thank you for having me. As you mentioned, we're working on a technology that makes gasoline, same gasoline that you're using in your car today, without using crude oil. Now, that's important because, as you know, for the last, since Richard Nixon, every president, including President Obama, has vowed to end our addiction to uh, crude oil, to petroleum. And we find ourselves today in a worse position than we've ever been. The demand for oil is at an all-time high. Uh, last week, China surpassed the U.S. as the largest consumer of energy in the world, and it's continuing to grow. Easy oil is behind us. Now, there's a reason that BP's drilling for oil 40 miles off the coast and two miles deep. It's very difficult to get at. And perhaps more importantly, uh, we don't control it. We don't control the supply. We don't have enough for ourselves. We don't control the pricing. And as a, uh, as a result, it's a catastrophic economic effect uh, on, on the country. Uh, in January, the trade deficit was $37.3 billion. 75% of that $27.5 billion was spent on oil. All right, so what can and you so do about it? What can you do about it specifically? So the idea is, can you make gasoline that uh -huh. fits into the existing infrastructure, the same cars you're driving, the same supply chain, without using crude oil? And that's the technology that we're working on. You mentioned greenhouse gases. Our feedstock is natural gas and carbon dioxide. Good news is, lots of it, relatively inexpensive, and we have plenty of it here in the United States to make the gasoline. Are you able to take those things and make them into gas gasoline for, or, or a fuel that a car runs off of? Yes, absolutely. The idea, it's, it's, the sector is called gas to liquids. The three major fossil fuels, of course, are oil, coal, and natural gas. Uh, the Germans made gasoline out of coal for years during the World War. Uh, you can make fuel out of natural gas. And so the answer is absolutely you can. There are some challenges. And uh, that, that's the next generation gas to liquid technology that we're working on. But uh, if you look at uh, where this becomes applicable, our technology needs those gases to be available in the same location. Low hanging fruit for us, natural gas facilities, landfills where there's a significant amount of natural gas and CO2 being produced every day. Typically what they do, they separate. It's an expensive process. The natural gas, which is considered valuable, goes into the distribution system. The CO2 gets vented into the air, which is not a good thing for anybody. Our technology takes the CO2, reacts it with the natural gas, the methane, with a chemical catalyst, and produces gasoline. Same gasoline that we're using today. All right, let's hope it works out. Brian, uh, Byron Elton is the president and CEO of Carbon Sciences joining me. Uh, thanks very much. All right, we're continuing our coverage of the immigration story. As you know, SB 1070, the Arizona state law, went into effect today, but with some big changes. Some of the most controversial parts are gone. So why are people protesting and getting arrested right now in Arizona? I'll tell you when we come back. Let me tell you about a very important phone call I made. When I got my Medicare card, I realized I needed an AARP Medicare Supplement Insurance card, too. Medicare is one of the great things about turning 65, but it doesn't cover everything. In fact, it only pays up to 80% of your Part B expenses. If you're already on or eligible for Medicare, call now to find out how an AARP Medicare Supplement Insurance plan, insured by United Healthcare Insurance Company, helps cover some of the medical expenses not paid by Medicare Part B. That can save you from paying up to thousands of dollars out of your own pocket. These are the only Medicare supplement insurance plans exclusively endorsed by AARP. When you call now, you'll get this free information kit with all you need to enroll. So you can join the millions of people who have already put their trust in AARP Medicare Supplement Insurance. Plus, you'll get this free guide to understanding Medicare. The prices are competitive. I can keep my own doctor. And I don't need a referral to see a specialist. Call now to get a free information kit. Plus, you'll get this free guide to understanding Medicare. And the advantages don't end there. Choose from a range of Medicare supplement plans that are all competitively priced. We have a plan for almost everyone, so you can find one that fits your needs and budget. With all Medicare supplement plans, there are virtually no claim forms to fill out. Plus, you can keep your own doctor and hospital that accepts Medicare. And best of all, these plans are the only Medicare supplement plans endorsed by AARP. When they told me these plans were endorsed by AARP, I had only one thing to say. Sign me up. Call the number on your screen now and find out about an AARP Medicare Supplement Insurance Plan. You'll get this free information kit and guide to understanding Medicare to help.